Hello and welcome to art. I'm Mrs. Pellucci. I wish I was talking to you in person, but unfortunately I'm talking to you from my kitchen. Um, so we're starting art today and I have your first activity ready to go for you. Um, this first activity is going to be something that we actually were gonna do in class regardless. Um, and that is a name design. Um, and to start, what I'd like you to do is, you know, gather up some paper. You can use copy paper, you can use lined paper, you can use sketchbook paper, whatever paper you have accessible to you, and a pencil. And I want you to make a list of all the things you can think of that you love. Um, it can be food, hobbies, sports, brands of clothing, pets that you have, or just animals in general that you like, um, books you read, musical instruments you play, or music that you like, um, your favorite holidays, places you love to visit, teams you root for. It could be anything that has to do with you and what you like. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this list and we're going to turn these images into letters. So for instance, down here, here's an A, and I constructed the A by taking a pencil, a marker, and an eraser, and put them in the shape of the A. And I did this because I am an art teacher and I love making art. But you can also just do the general shape of things. So like the general shape of a slice of pizza upside down is kind of like an A, okay? And you could even add things onto here if you wanted to, like I could add a golf club, I could add the golf tee, because I'm a golfer, okay, to even make it look more like an A. So um, to get started, what I'm gonna have you do is, once you have your list, um, so hopefully you can see, like I've started to write down some of the list of things that I like. Um, I'm gonna be starting to garden, so gardening is something I could put on there art, um, I love to bake, um, I love to read Harry Potter, Christmas and Halloween are my favorite, some of my favorite holidays. I like to wear Vans, I play the ukulele, I play softball, I love watching football, I root for the Bills, pizza, candy, gummy bears, and the list goes on. So once you have your list, you're going to then sketch out your um, name. So I'm gonna do my first and my last name and I'm just gonna lightly, lightly, lightly sketch out my name. Now you can do uppercase, you can do lowercase, you can do a combination of the two. Make these a little darker so you can see them, okay? And now I'm gonna do my last name, move this up a little. Okay, so from here, once I have my letters sketched out, now I can start to plug in pictures. So for instance, my first A here, I could do um, the slice of pizza from my previous example, all right? And um, this shape right here kind of reminds me of the tip of a football, so I could turn this into a football. Okay. Uh, let's see. I could turn one of my A's into an evergreen tree. Because I love Christmas, but I also love camping and hiking. And that makes me think of the forest. This eye down here could be turned into a lightning bolt because I love Harry Potter. So what you wanna do is you just wanna kinda start to go through and turn these letters into pictures. Sometimes you can just use one image. So for instance here, I just used the clover and now I'm erasing the rest of the O. But you can also morph your image. For instance, if I wanted to make this look like a campfire, I could just morph the fire into the shape of a U Okay, instead of um, trying to construct or find something that's a U-shaped, I just made the fire look like a U. 
But you can also build thing, build a letter. So for instance, N, nothing is really the shape of an N, but I could do like a Nike logo. I could do a softball bat here. Oh, that's a little funky there. I could do a softball bat right here. And this could be a field hockey stick. I used to play field hockey. Okay, so um, just to kind of show you what mine looks like when I'm done, all right. Um, so all of my letters have been replaced with pictures. And you can see it says Amanda Pellucci. Okay, now you can go further with this if you want. You could add some shading, you know, color things in with your pencil. You could outline it with a pen or a Sharpie if you had, if you had access to one. Um, you could color it in with colored pencil. Um, really from here, you could do any of that or you could just leave it as a pencil drawing. Um, but uh, make sure you replace all the letters of your name with pictures. Okay, have fun.